This is Chris's beauty. Some of you might have seen this because we have just a few videos of it. Yeah, at least two or three. Come on, Chris, lights. Lights. Come on. Come on. It's not expensive. There you go. So, I just quickly introduced this for those people who have no idea about it. Quite a mad build we've done in the last two years. Up front, we have three way with front sub. We have the Micro Precision uh, Z Series tweeters now with the Audible Physics NZ3 LB three inch widebands in the pillars. Super heavy, crazy heavy builds on the pillars, zero resonance. Then we have, at the moment, we have our Arco mid base drivers based on Acuton original seven inch mid base drivers in the kicks in sealed enclosures. Um, and then we have a Pioneer ODR 10 inch sub up front, playing down to like 35, 30, 30 35 hertz, because the rear sub does the low end only, like the infra range. Um, then we have Helix DSP Pro Mark II running the system with the director, but we also left the old head unit, which is a Pioneer P90, super expensive CD player with its deck at the back taste the legal car and at the back we have an FI IB3 15 inch sub in true IB so it breathes through the back of the car underneath the uh, rear bumper and it plays down to silly single digits has proper wobble wind that's the job all the, really all, the that stuff. all the craziness um, so this is the helix DSP Pro power distribution over there and that's where we have the amps, two DLS TA2 uh, on the top, one running mid, the other one running tweeters. And then underneath, we have same size uh, uh, DLS A5s, three channel amps out of what uh, the two stereo channels bridge run one mid base up front. And then the single channels run one, one sub each. So one runs front sub, the other one runs the rear sub. Just show the amp track from here. We might have a better view of it. Oh, but let's tip this seat if I can. There we are. So this is where we have the amp rec. You just can't see the, the bottom two amps. So yeah, this is it. Chris, one of those um, carbon pieces slid out. You have to pull it back a bit. Oh boy. Cool. So this was a TT. Thanks, Chris. See ya.